In this video, I am going to find uh, C scan Dix Schedule algorithm. And uh, this problem, there are uh, Dix with 200 tracks and the queue has random requests from different processes in the order 55, 58, 39, 18, 19, 160, 150, 38, 184. Initially at 100, previous was at 85. A plus C scan Dix Schedule algorithm to find average head movement. First of all, we need to draw the total number of track, 200 track and this is up to 199 and we divide this uh, track as 20 gap we can use 10 gap also or 30 gap also uh, 100 this one is 100 120 140 160 180 and so on so this is the total number of track uh, initially at 100 the initial is the most important thing and previous was 85 we will consider everything, every calculation from this initial state. So, this algorithm move from one end to another end, from left to right or you can move uh, towards uh, left also. I am choosing to right direction, forward direction. So, first of all, 100, then we will choose the next path that is 150, and next one is 150, uh, then we will choose 160, we are uh, moving toward the 199. And next one is 184. Then it will access the last you know, that is uh, 199. Then uh, return from this 199 to 199 to 0. Why? Because during the returning, we will not visit any track. Then it will return the circular way that is from towards the forward way. Then it move toward the forward way that is it will visit 18, uh, then 38, then 39, then uh, 38, 39, then uh, 18, 38, 39, 55, then 58, uh, then 90. This was the last 90. So this is known as C-scan, like circular scan. First time initially it moved toward the right the forward direction, then again uh, after rotating it will move to the forward direction. So total head movement, now total head movement equal to uh, 199 minus 8500, 199 minus 100 plus 100, this was the initial stage and then 199 minus 0, then 90 minus 0. These are the total head movement. 